Hi, we're back at Wayne's World. I'm Professor Greenway, and I'm with Bud. And here we're going to sing about a friend of ours, Mark. He's in jail. He hasn't done anything. He hasn't hurt anybody, but he's in jail anyway because somebody decided somewhere that uh, there ought to be something called prohibition on cannabis. Can you say that? Prohibition? Well, it's illegal because in Canada, we've got a law. It's called the Constitution Act of Canada. And in it, it says we're subject to the, such rules as can be demonstrably justified in a free and democratic society. Well, there's never been demonstrable justification for prohibition, but for trying to get prohibition repealed, Mark Emery's spending five years in jail in America, facilitated by and uh, assisted by the conservatives, the conservative government. They're basically breaking the law, having him kidnapped and taken across international borders against his will, without justification for that either. And if the Conservative Party doesn't respect Mark Emery's rights, what makes you think they would respect yours if it was you? We're here to tell everybody, if you know somebody who might be voting Conservative, re-educate them now before it's too late. Stop fascism and let's free Mark. <laughs>
labor form. It should be governed by anything. It should be the Department of Agriculture and the Department of Industry encouraging people to grow as much hemp and cannabis as possible. All sorts of wonderful things come out of it. Alternative fuel. Ever think it's a coincidence those guys in the oil companies and the governments and the car companies all work together to keep us on oil? We could have had electric cars a long time ago. We could have had flying electric cars. I'm not kidding. Governments want flying electric cars? Orders would be meaningless. Who wants a world of peaceful people when you could have war industries dividing everyone? Making lots of money for people who do nothing to create, only destroy. They're creating a prison industrial complex. Let's go hand in glove with the military industrial complex. The world police state. Do you like fascism? Do you think those Nazis were right? Who do you think won World War II? Prescott Bush knew. Today, people, if you don't want to be going around saying Hal Harper or ratting on anybody who you know who might be a Jew, DU, drug user, then it's time to stop the madness. Stop fascism today. <laughs>